The marathon is over, there's nothing more for me to do. The studio is ready to be opened up in half an hour. It's sunny outside and the snow is melting. I couldn't believe my eyes when I woke up to snow this morning, but it should melt throughout the day, so <laughs> I want spring by now. I'm gonna sit down with a cup of coffee and then soon I'm going to fully open up. It looks so great in here. Just on my way out of the door to do some grocery shopping. When you've been running fast and your body is starting to feel super drained, it's just so amazing to experience the support I've received over the past 24 hours on the new designs, on the launch. I'm just so grateful if you have bought something, if you have commented something nice on social media if you have liked something shown any support i just want to say thank you um i've noticed everything and it means a lot so it's been a lovely day and it's just been a lovely past 24 hours and even though i'm exhausted it's been worth it and now i'm gonna spend the night all tucked up on the sofa and now it just started raining. <laughs> All I want to do right now is this. <clears throat> but we need to go. There's no better way to spend a slow Sunday than spending some quality time with my plants. And this big one was in need of a new pot. But I realized here that this braided one was going to be too small so I found another one that I had in the garden clay one and it was quite perfect so I had her replanted in this cold weather luckily today with no snow that I'm going to try to propagate my massive monstera that's been living in my studio for the past three years. It's growing out of its pot in one direction and it's just massive by now so it's perfect to take some babies from it and to create some new plants. So I've been looking up a YouTube video on how to do that and um, <laughs> I'm gonna get down to it. We've got our first baby. It really feels like I'm doing something criminal here. I've never caught in a plant like this before. And just like that, we now got four Monstera babies. We're going to put them into water. 
I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with the big Monstera right now. If this turns out to be a success, I might try to make some more Monstera babies on her. Replant her. Just be patient. That's probably the plan. So now I'm going to wait for a few weeks. Hopefully it's going to grow some roots and then I can plant them into some soil. This is so exciting and I would be lying if I said that I have not had a peek in here. I've been sent a package with Easter treats from the British Corner Shop. So this should be full of British chocolate. That's what I hope. Percy Pick and Colin the Caterpillar. I've never seen these before. It feels like a sort of type of like gummy bear candy. So usually not something I would go for, but it's gonna be fun to try it. Oh, dangerously delicious. I think this is another one, Chiquitas Cracking Easter. Mm. Love myself some chocolate. We have one that's wrapped in fragile. I wonder what's going to be more fragile than Easter eggs. We have four blueberry. Oof, damn it. I don't like berries, but my family can taste this with me. And four bramble apple, Cadbury, flake, one large egg and three bars. Last thing is a box within the box. It says Brit Kits. Your British favorites have arrived. I was honestly hoping for these to be in the box. I've never had these before. I see them every, it's snowing. I just see these everywhere online around Easter. It's the Cadbury Mini Eggs. Can't wait to try those. Milky Bar White Chocolate Egg. Mm. Galaxy Caramel Mini Eggs. We have Jelly Baby Chickens. Ooh, a Mini Egg Chocolate Bar. Kit Kat and Mochises Chocolate. Love that. Oh, I really hope for these as well. I've got these cream eggs that I have also seen and heard everybody talk about. It's snowing. It's massively snowing now. Why? My first ever Cadbury cream egg. Please don't disappoint. <laughs> It's like, it's like the luxury version of a Kinder Egg. It's good that we have the British Corner Shop because I fear I'm gonna be wanting more of these. That's really good. And last of all, in the box, a Smarties Bunny. Love Smarties. I can't wait to try everything little by little. Already super happy to have tried these. Thank you so much, British Corner Shop. Welcome to what I think is going to be the biggest order packing day I've ever had and that requires two things, iced coffee that I made at home and my slippers. My mom have made me these elf slippers in wool and they're simply the best thing to wear in the studio so I'm going to get changed out of my boots and pour myself some iced coffee. 
and it's the perfect weather to stay indoor and pack some mortars. I can get all of those packages to the post office by bus so my mom is gonna come by soon and help me I think the reason why I'm so overwhelmed and so grateful for this weekend is because last year with everything that happened especially the second half of last year the business was going down a little bit um, like when you have a business you do look at numbers and so do I and it scared me and I think I've been afraid that maybe I wasn't gonna get a weekend like this again having a launch that was gonna go down well and feeling this sort of proud feeling again so it's just a massive victory to me and I'm just like I'm really 100 degrees, it feels like I'm sick, but I'm just so happy and so grateful. <sighs> I've said thank you so many times, but just thank you. And um, I should drink some water. <laughs> Stay hydrated when I'm this feeling this hot. Thank you so much for watching this video. I promise we'll be back to house renovations in the next one.